Okay, welcome back to my channel. This is BS Academy. Students, at the first part, we have learned some important short question from the topic profit and loss. Uh, if you do not watch that video, please visit it at once. And today we are going to learn uh, some long question and very very important long question from the topic profit and loss. Let's get it start. First one question: One fifth of cost price and one sixth of selling price are equal. Find the profit or loss percent. In this question, uh, let b x and s b b y then according to the question one fifth of cost price one fifth of one fifth of cost price equals to one sixth of selling price this is equal and this is given in the question then 1 upon 5 times cp is x equals to 1 upon 6 times y uh, x upon 5 equals to y upon 6 this can be written as x equals to 5y upon 6 and y equals to 6x upon 5 clearly uh, y is bigger than x that means y is bigger means there is profit upon we have to calculate the profit percentage percent equals to sp minus cp divided by cp times 100 percent sp is y minus x upon x times 100 percent then replace the value of y which is 6x upon 5 minus x upon x times 100 percent then solve by taking lcm at the numerator this is x and 5 is LCM 6x minus 5x times 100%. This is equals to x upon 5 times 1 upon x times 100%. Then x x cancel out. 100 divided by 5 is 20% is the required answer. Question number 2. 40% of the cost price and 50% of the selling price are equal. Find the profit or loss percentage again. Uh, let C P B X and S P B Y. According to the question, forty percent of C P forty percent of C P equals to fifty percent of S P. This is or forty upon hundred times X equals to. 50 upon 100 times sp is y then reduce it into lowest form 0 0 cancel out 2 2 za 4 2 x upon 2 5 za 10 equals to 50 2 za 100 means y upon 2 this can be written as uh, x equals to 5 y upon 4 and y equals to 4 x upon 5 uh, then clearly 5 upon 4 is bigger than 4 upon 5. X is bigger means there is loss happened. Then we have to calculate loss percent. Loss percent equals to CP minus SP. Divided by CP times 100%. CP equals to X minus Y upon X times 100%. Uh, now replace the value of y x minus value of y is 4x upon 5 divided by x times 100 percent then solve by taking lcm at the numerator there is 5x minus 4x upon 5 divided by x times 100 percent then by using law of reciprocal there is x upon 5 times 1 upon x times 100 percent x x cancel out 520 is a 100. This is required answer. Okay, question number 3. Gun is about 222 kg sugar at the rate of RS 120 per kg. He paid transportation cost at the rate of RS 10 per kg. If he sold all the sugar at RS 36,075, what profit percent did he make? In this question, we have to calculate total CP of 222 kg sugar with the transportation cost. SP total SP is given, then we can calculate profit percentage. CP of 1 kg sugar is 
that is 120 then cp of 222 kg sugar is is 222 times 120 then transportation cost for for 1 kg is transportation cost rst that means transportation cost for for 222 kg equals to rs 222 times 10 is total cp equals to rs 222 or times 120 plus rs 220 times 10 is equals to rs Okay, total CP is 28,860 and total SP is given 36,075. Clearly, uh, SP is bigger than CP. That means we have to calculate profit percentage. Now, profit percentage equals to profit percent equals to SP minus CP upon CP times 100 percent. This is equals to SP is 36,075 minus 28,860 upon 28,860 times 100% this is equals to 36,075 minus 28,860 is 7,215 divided by 28,860 times 100% this is equals to 25% this is our required answer Okay, next one question. A dealer purchased 30 dozen cups at RS360 per dozen. 40 of them were broken and sold the rest at RS37.50 per cup. What is his percentage of profit or loss? That means we have to calculate total CP and total SP. In this question, uh, CP of 1 dozen, CP of 1 dozen cup equals to RS. This is 360. This is given. Then CP of 30 dozen means CP of 30 360 cups equals to RS 30 times 360 this is RS 1800 then 40 of them were broken means remaining number of cups equals to 360 total number of cups minus 40 is 320 then sp of 1 cup equals to rs 37.50 means sp of uh, 320 cups equals to rs 120 times 37.50 this is equals to rs 12000 uh, clearly uh, sp is bigger than cp that means we have to calculate uh, profit percentage now profit percentage equals to sp minus cp upon cp times 100 percent then sp is given 12,000 minus cp is 10,800 divided by 10,800 times 100 percent Uh, 12,000 minus 10,800 is just 1,200 upon 10,800 times 100 percent this is equals to 11.11 percent is percentage of profit okay last one question Parvati about 40 glasses uh, 20 of them were broken she sold the remaining glasses it is 25 per glass making 20 percent profit in whole transaction find the cost price of each glasses in this question sp of one glass is given that is 25 then 20 of them were broken out of 60 glass means remaining glass is 40 glass uh, sp of 40 glasses equals to rs 25 times 40 this is rs 1000 and profit is given 
profit percent is given which is 20 percent then sp and profit percent is given we can find cp cp equals to sp times 100 divided by 100 plus profit percentage sp is 1000 times 100 divided by 100 plus 20 and this is this is 1 lakh upon 120 equals to 833.33 okay this is cp of 60 glasses because he made a profit 20 percent on whole transaction i um, mean cp of 60 glasses equals to rs 833.33 then cp of one glass equals to rs 833.33 upon 60 this is equals to rs 13.88 cost price of each class okay i have finished my lesson if you have any questions you can leave your comment below in a comment section see you in next video bye bye